Hello. So, talking about Sublime Text, um, you can see here that we get we view in the browser. I also have open in the browser, and while this one works, uh, this one do not works and uh, doesn't work, and um, and I cannot do the I could now I can I cannot do the Control Alt and V to see this. This is very handy. Uh, so it makes us save a lot of time. So um, I checked out how to do it and I finally find it looking in the internet other things and so you have to go here in preferences and package setting and you see view in the browser so you got setting default and setting use for the user. So let's go into in setting default and as you can see here, we got the default one, and mm, there, there must be ways to change this, but uh, maybe I don't know, open it, I don't know, but I do in a very easy way. Uh, so the, the fact is, is that the path here is not right, because I don't have it into the problem files, and with this parenthesis here, it's not in this folder and you gotta check, her, check out into your installation for example here you go in, um, in your hard drive and you go into the program or program into a parenthesis s86 but my google chrome it's not in here but it's in here so it doesn't it's not right for the way it is uh, into the Supreme Text Pad that you've seen before. And if you go here, you go in Google, Chrome, um, application, you see that the Chrome Exe file is here. So you can, you can see here, it's C, uh, column slash program files, Google Chrome application, and then Chrome Exe. So uh, instead here, it's program files, and uh, parentheses x86 uh, in here and in here for the Chrome 64 uh, version of it. So what we can do is to copy all of this and to go back in the preferences, package settings, view in the browser, and this time instead of using setting default, you go setting user, and I have already did it here, but you get to copy let's delete this uh, copy what we, from the, the from the um, how is it called uh, the default uh, user and go and then the default settings and you you go into the user setting and so now they are just the same but you're going you are going to delete here these parentheses both here and here if you got eventually the chrome 32 bit version that it's not very huge uh, it will be not here okay i think uh good change also get the browser to chrome save it and now it will finally work so we we'll go here and if you go um, see in the browser you will see it or you can do ctrl alt and v finally and it will work and it will be really faster and will be very satisfying for you to go through the 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 code let's say so and the uh, actual rendering of the page into chrome so that's all see you soon and bye